Tyler, I've got to start by saying two goals. Where's that come from? I don't actually know, to be fair. <laughs> um, obviously, I've, I've said to you in the past that I've wanted to score goals and um, I feel like I've been unlucky recently, especially last game. You know, I think Notts County keeper saved it with his head, my header. Um, you know, obviously, I'm, I'm delighted to get two goals today, but the main thing is we've got three points and obviously we banged in five goals. Obviously, you got two goals yourself, but it was a brilliant team performance as well, wasn't it? Yeah, definitely. Obviously, you look at the other other lads that got on the score sheet, Ryan, Justin, obviously, and he with a penalty, and he could have had a couple more. Um, but we know what he's going to bring us. He's a menace, you know, to a centre half. You know, I've played against him. He's horrible to play against. Um, Justin on his day, 1v1, there's, I don't really know many people in this league that will stop him. Ryan is just, his energy is just crazy. What he gives you, obviously, on the ball, but off the ball, you know, he, he averages out 12, 12k a game, which is just ridiculous. If I'd done that, I'd have broken legs, you know what I mean? Um, you know, he doesn't have many one-on-one -on -one opportunities, but he took it really well. And obviously, Justin Gold was, was a corker, and obviously, and he deserved his penalty as well. So, um, all round, it was a great team performance. Um, if you look at Halifax, you know, they, they had a bit of possession, but they didn't really hurt us. Obviously, mm -hmm. they, they scored a goal straight after our one, but I looked at it and thought it was a real foul. Um, you know, the, the striker was all over our, our centre-half, and... Um, he stopped him from jumping, so I thought it was a foul, but then obviously it didn't affect us, where in recent weeks it maybe has a little bit. Um, and, you know, we went on and got three points to score five goals. Obviously, it was unlucky to, to concede that goal, but it was a really sound defensive um, performance. Do you think you, you lads are forming a real partnership and, and a bond there, the back four? Yeah, definitely. I think the whole team's, you know, making a bond together. Um, you know, it's not just on the pitch, it's off the pitch as well. Like, we're, we're a good set of, good, good set of lads and... Um, you know, we every day in training, you know, we're we're always asking for each other to become better and um, do extras and stuff like that. And our team performances are just coming out now. Obviously, the last two games at home we've won um, and quite comfortably as well, especially tonight. Um, Halifax are no no team that you know you can take lightly. You know, obviously, you look at last season, they, they were, I think they were in the playoffs last season, weren't they? Mm. Um, you know, they're they're a great side and obviously, but tonight we're, we're very good. Obviously. We've been very unlucky so far this season in a lot of the games. So does that send a bit of a message that you know when things can go our way, that's what we can do. We can we can blow teams away. Yeah, definitely. I think like this league, it's just sometimes you don't understand it. Um, any team can beat anyone. Uh, whenever really, you know, you look at Wrexham's and Chesterfield's. You know, they might go and lose to a Dorking or something, mm. and you're not expecting it, but. Um, on their day, any any team in this league is good, and the good thing about us, our counter attacks uh, are so fast, and you know we break with real pace and, and menace, and um, you know with with obviously the big man up there, he's, he just crushes centre backs, and um, you know on a, on another day we probably could have had seven or eight tonight, and um, we just look to take that into our next game. Click here for the latest match highlights and click here to subscribe. Are you in with a shot? Look below for more information.